we want to determine the volume of the given solid. To determine the volume, we will cut or decompose the solid into two right rectangular prisms or two boxes. So we can determine the volume using the volume formula, V equals length times width times height, which gives the volume of a right rectangular prism or a box as shown here. And we can cut the solid into two boxes two ways. If we cut it horizontally here, we have a box on the top and a box on the bottom. If we cut it vertically here, we have a box on the left and a box on the right. So let's go ahead and cut it vertically here and determine the volume of the box on the right and the box on the left and then sum the two volumes. Let's begin by sketching all the edges for the two boxes. And now to help us determine the volume of the box on the right, let's highlight the edges for the box on the right. Let's call the volume of the box on the right V sub R. We'll notice how the height is six feet. This edge is a length of five feet. We need to find the length of this edge here. But the length of this edge is the same length as this edge down here, which is seven feet. And therefore the box has a length of seven feet, the longest edge, a width of five feet, and a height of six feet. And therefore the volume of the box on the right is equal to seven feet times five feet times six feet, which is equal to 210 cubic feet. And now let's highlight the edges of the box on the left in green and then determine the volume. For the box on the left, we know the height is four feet. The length of this edge here is seven feet. But notice how we don't have the length of this edge here, but we do know the length of this edge here this long edge is 13 feet. We also know the length of this edge is five feet, and therefore 13 feet minus five feet will give us the length of this edge here. 13 feet minus five feet is eight feet. So now we know the length of this edge is eight feet. And now that we have the dimensions, we can determine the volume. The volume of the box on the left we'll call V sub L is equal to the length of eight feet times the width of seven feet, times the height of four feet. Eight times seven times four is equal to 224. The volume is 224 cubic feet. And therefore the total volume, and therefore the total volume V is equal to the volume of the box on the right, V sub R, plus the volume of the box on the left, V sub L, and 210 plus 224 is equal to 434. The total volume V is equal to 434 cubic feet. I hope you found this helpful.